One of the key ways of winning on Blast Ball is to know when to pick your fights along with knowing the different ways to eliminate people. How people often die in the early game of Blast Ball is they will try and pick a ball from the edges and just get sniped when they least expect it. What you should do at the start is play a more defensive and passive strategy while occasionally throwing bombs into the crowds while on the edges. I will caution you and just say not to go to the center because everyone will be throwing bombs there. However, don't stay on the edges for too long either. Move around the map constantly and know when to pick your fights. The best time to let go of the ball is when it starts to beep really fast. Just let go of your grab and it will travel forwards. Don't jump dive for the ball cause it will go really far and you won't be able to hit anyone. Instead jump and let go of the bomb if you need to chuck it far away. If you are really close to people you can let go of the bomb later. Gauging when to let go of the bomb will take time but the further you are from people the earlier you should let go of the ball. Learning to snipe players who are on the edges of the map and just not aware of the surroundings is a great skill to practice. However one of the best ways to get people eliminated is to essentially run up to their faces and let the ball explode blank point range. The ball will blast them away while you will be left mostly unharmed. However, this could be very dangerous to do at the end game because you won't have much real estate left if you do happen to get blasted. But early to mid game, this strategy works incredibly well, but only do this if they're near the edges of the map. However, if a ball is about to explode, you can grab it and chuck it away from you. This can save your life if you do it fast enough. Heck, you can even use this to your advantage actually. You can just grab a ball, let go of the ball and when it's about to explode, just pick it up again and throw it forwards. Another thing that I don't see people do enough is that when a ball is about to approach them, instead of running away from the ball, what you do is you run to the ball and jump over it. Doing this will make it so the ball will blast you upwards only instead of sideways, which could save you from elimination. If you see someone near you with a ball, just try grabbing them because the bomb will just fly out of their hands if you do so. A tactic that is very underrated in my opinion is to throw your bombs at other people's bombs. If a bomb explodes with other bombs near it, they'll explode as well creating a chain reaction of sorts. This is a great way of dwindling the enemy supply and the process you could get them eliminated as well. Often I along with many others would just slip off the edges on the center and die. To avoid this I would say to grab the bomb and move away from the center as soon as possible. Or in general just avoid the center set of balls if you are able to. If you are one side of the map and someone is directly in front of you but on the other side of the map, a way to snipe them will be to run and throw the bomb right when it starts to turn red. And with any luck it should hit them by the time the ball lands. Learning to chuck the bombs far distances is something you should definitely practice. While a risky strat, you can just walk up to people and try to push them off the platform, but you can only really do this if they're pushed up against the edge. Playing passive in the beginning and more aggressive as the game goes on is almost a winning formula. Learning when to pick your fights and to be aware of your surroundings is critical. Never just stand in one place for too long, especially in mid to late game. Throw bombs that are about to explode if they happen to be near you as well. And a great way to eliminate people is just to walk up to them with a ball and let it explode in their face, but only will you do this if they happen to be near the edges. 